Man, did you just hit yourself in the face? This guy Me? Must yeah. Have no, I did not, oh, sir. It sounded like that. I didn't even really raise my hand. Damn. That's how one cops of these, use the phone. One of these days. Hiding from the wife? I think McMurdy? Phelps, batch 1247. Case the fuck is McMurdy? How could I help is that even a real fucking name? McMurty? Yeah, look at that shit across the street. McCaffrey. Yeah, I guess so. McCaffrey. I feel like six. these... One, two, six, I've, we've said before, three. these have to be, like, dramatically shortened for time. Wouldn't this phone call take, like, half an hour? Yeah. Did it. Yeah, we don't live in a place with lots of Irish immigrants, so we don't have lots of Irish immigrant names. Am I in it? No. No, I'm not. What? Are you Irish? Yeah. Jesus Christ. I was like, am I Irish? No. Aren't you the first person to, to say that, like, I, I'm one, you're ginger despite Yeah, but I, I sometimes I forget. I'm 164th Irish, which is like wrong person away. nothing on what. Everyone's 163rd Irish, basically. Yeah, that's the law. Fucking rusty. Wow. What did he say? Would it bother you to put the wrong person away? It depends on what. On whether or not anyone finds out. <laughs> Holy shit! That's a rusty. Jesus. Christ! But even if that- Because we're already solving cases! Even if that part doesn't bother you, doesn't it bother you that the person who committed the crime can just commit more bonus crime? Well, that's the thing, is like, the possibility that these cases are actually unsolving as I go. Is yeah, it's starting to look that right. way, huh? Well, in Rusty's case, I think it's like they don't find a guy and there's really no evidence at all, and Rusty's like, eh, I just want to go home. But if they find a guy and there's no evidence at all for that murder, but that guy's like, hey, I fuck bodies! Like, he'll put him away. He'll put him away it for sure. it saves time, I guess. But what, what I don't, what's really, like, I guess weird is how each one of these women has enough of a, like, perp in their life that's not the main guy that they can still go there. Well, it's fuck. L.A. There's tons of scumbags around. I guess. I just, oof. What the hell, you know? And this is pre-DNA. And your partner's rusty. Yeah. This shit happens. Man, it happens a lot. Look, give him a little, little friendly police little nudge, nudge just to remind him. Looking forward to that arson desk. Oh, oh yeah, that's a good no, one. No, I'm not. <laughs> well, you got vice first. That's the fun one. The one with the human trafficking in it. Yeah. This seems like a turn. The one, the one desk that keeps on giving. I fucking hate the vice desk. Rollins bowling. I like to learn. Rollins rolling. Seth Rollins bowling with 100% more naked pictures. And pushing. Get pushed and, for big and, heat. And fucking up moves. I fucked the move up. Oh. Broke his face again. Hello, Rusty. Two on your usual lane. Why is it a weird nurse? I'm Detective I love Phelps. this old lady so Homicide. much. Wearing a you baby thing. <laughs> Yes, yeah, well, she's wearing the baby. We're conducting an investigation. It's what you put on old babies. <laughs> yeah, you know the name, <laughs> old Evelyn babies, Summers? huh? Oh yeah, the really like old I babies. Should. Yeah, like Benjamin Button. Oh, maybe it could be Jimmy's friend. Bonnet. Jimmy. James Tiernan. He's a pin setter. Mm. One day he. It was the bowling pin man. To a lady and she had work. a bowling pin. The man with the one arm, the, the arm that had the bowling pin in it. Much older, too old for him. Ooh. Where can we find Jimmy Florence? He'll be hopping around the lane. If your name is Florence, Thanks, you man. are you will be an old woman. Let's go get him. He's gonna Eventually. run. <laughs> this camera is gonna fucking turn into a chase cam any minute. Possibly. Um, like I don't remember this. I believe it was back the way that well. yeah, back where you were. Okay. The other thing, too, is, um, uh, uh, I like how they had to talk loudly to the old lady. Well, if you want LP funsies, can you fuck up people's games? Can you get in front of them? Oh, yeah. Because I don't fuck remember that guy's this area game at all. What's a special Just push you know? him down. Invisible wall? Try and fuck Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Try and bowl now, motherfucker. <laughs> what are you going to do about it? Is he not going to do it? Do you have to get out of the way? I think you have to be a certain distance. Either that, or he's just gonna stay there forever, like it's fucking. Because some people were rolling their balls down the lanes, like. Oh no! Oh, oh, he's oh. oh he's he's literally not okay, doing it until mind, you get a never certain mind, distance. Never mind. Never mind then. They knew this would happen. Damn it! Gutter ball, fucking. Oh Christ! Fucking destroyed your concentration. You're that cop that ruined my perfect game. Ah! 
You'll never get Nugget Phelps, now. Phelps, the bull stopper. Captain Donnelly would like to speak to you, Mr. Phelps. He wants to give you a commendation for ruining that man's bowling game. All right, so who's the POI? It was behind you, again. Uh, which person? It's behind the bowling, dude. You go the left side by the lanes. Rusty told you, the lady told you, I told you. It's that. Oh my fucking god. Look, there's a door there. there. That door, it's it's just behind Sorry, the Sorry, when you said behind the lanes, I, I didn't know you meant like two, but yeah, okay. Well, Rusty said it's to the left behind the lanes. Yep, yep, yep. Called well, right. it. Hey, hey. Hey, you know what you're doing? You're fucking up these people's bowling games. Because no one's gonna set the pins now. God. Throw a bowling ball at his car quick. Uh. We'll just steal this car. Yeah, why not? Just it's uh, it's, it's unlocked. Up. It's insane how e how it's it's o how okay it is to run from the cops. Like they can get they can run away, get caught, and go. Oh well, okay, I guess I'll talk. And then they just ignore the other part. Middle-aged individual with the need to feel virile. Also, it's crazy how you're allowed to Don't shoot. To sleep on me. Get me back in Remember, Wooly, this is how you turn in LA. Oh, you got him. When your turn signals would just not be good enough, you shoot to the left to tell people that you'll be turning. But they always seem to. Damn it! I wanted that line. No, nope. gotta run. He oh, said I that guy was. Running. I want to think that, that I got the wrong person sometimes, but they always seem to lamb it. Like every single person you That's find exa runs. Exactly. <laughs> Fuck yeah, Phelps. Totally. What the fuck? Oh, oh, oh yeah! It was a ghost! Ghost! Oh! Time. Yes! What is happening? Shut, Shut up! Don't worry about it's that. It's a city of ghosts! I'm missing content! No way! No, you missed nothing. You shut up. What just happened? No, shut up. Someone is in the back of some paddy wagon Hold somewhere. On. Hold on. Okay. What did we learn from nothing and no one? Oh, God. McCaffrey's apartment would be the next one. It would be, but let me see. Hold on. Did he no. give us anything? No, that was Tiernan, man. I know, but did he, he did not give you anything? You saw him and you booked him. Well, now that you I'm just afraid of what that what that. Okay, meant. I think Central Police Station is that because we that's just to interview him. That, yeah, the guy yeah. that we just arrested. So you definitely want to hit that the cafeteria department first. Yeah, I'm just the, the gentleman caller. I'm just wondering if like other things didn't pop up as a result. No, I nah, think that's don't worry about, about it. It's about Weird. Yeah. <laughs> What a oh, yes. If he could just turn I into a ghost, how come he didn't just do that and, like, run away? Hey. If the dead are committing so crimes, you know? how are you supposed to stop them? And can you put them away? Yeah, I don't or think do a bars will be good enough. Need that fucking weird containment cube from fucking Twin Peaks. Oh, yeah. Need ghost cops. You see Inferno Cop is renewed for another season? I sure fucking did. That's yeah. amazing. With Cole Phelps as That's Inferno insane. Cop. Why? Who would do this? Heroes. Oh shit! Oh! Threading the needle. Yeah, it's hard. That's good shit. Done. It's extra impressive in the first swerve. You didn't even touch the sides of either car. <laughs> Drive safely. Ghost cops. I miss hearing this song. Yeah, it's really nice. Would you like that that cutscene, the ghost cops, have no dialogue, or, or like what it did? Whoa. Where there is dialogue, which would have been funnier. Dialogue. Yeah. Right. Definitely. I would have loved floating hats. What about like their hats didn't disappear? What about invisible assassins' creed faces? Oh, is That's this the also way? Good. It might not be. Hit the, the square. Way. Yeah, it's scary. Okay, so yeah, it is the right way. He would have told you to turn back if the, it wasn't. The deadly underpasses. Keep on straight till morning, Mr. Phelps. Oh shit! That's good enough. This is fine. If you're going forward, it's fine. Oh my god. Although, I kind of feel like the city is actually quite small. I feel like we'll always go by the same Well, part of the problem things. is that, um... It's way bigger than the game The, the, the open world has absolutely no reason to exist There's, there's yeah, no reason for it. it. That's the main thing, yeah. I think it's just because cases bring us to the same areas. I feel like they could have saved a shitload of time, money, and manpower by just not having the open world at all. And just having like a couple of unique areas. But I feel like also when they were probably they probably presented that idea and they're like, nah man, people like they want like a GTA thing and they just felt like they had to put it yeah, on the Yeah, and then the director was complain. like, My name's McNamara and I wanna work my employees like fucking slaves because I'm a piece of shit. Yeah. 
I don't know what he's doing nowadays. Also, he's being they, not in game development, I yeah, don't think. They, they yeah. also have the engine and infrastructure to build an open world. He got fucking blown up the hardest ever as the worst boss in games. Mm. I seriously doubt he's working on anything right now. Rockstar Man? No. No, he's uh, not Rockstar Team man. Bondi Man. Uh, Subsidiary Mac of Rockstar Mac that worked out in Australia. Yeah, McNamara is like, that's that's his last name. I don't I forget his first name. I think it was Brendan. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I think it was. But, uh,. Yeah, it's like straight up just piece of shit slave driver crunch forever. Crunch for years. You're never not going to be crunched. So like what happens is is this game comes out, gets great reviews, the studio shuts down immediately. <laughs> Sells pretty well. Did we get an apartment number? Uh you like might want to check the front. That might have been yeah. at the front. But really you could have just looked for the the, 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 lights. the lit door and the gold handle, but yeah. Okay. Uh, it's like, not going to be on the first floor. It's no, all I know. definitely not. But I'm just looking for like where, like a name ledger would be. Yeah, it's out there. Like okay, there we go. Fucking gold handled doors. Okay, what do we got? Look for McNamara. Oh, you found it McCaffrey's immediately. Six. Six. Got it. Let's go toss McCaffrey's place. Warrant without a warrant. What's a warrant? It's yeah. that thing those pussy bureaucrats keep telling me I need. While crimes are being committed. Hey, hey. Anybody home? Oh, it's such a nice picture of a woman and her cow. What's up? Toss it. Toss it real good. Pee, pee on a lot of things, but not everything. Slowly push his plants onto the put floor. Put some Funko Pops oh, in his man. apartment. Wooly, you have plenty of Funko Pops to put in his apartment. You're getting I'm more Funko control. Pops every day. <laughs> yeah, you don't know it. Nothing with this. Part. I bought a drone recently, so guess what's been going inside and outside your apartment? Every day. <laughs> oh shit. I wish I had a drone to do that. Well, no, the ultimate is if we get his girlfriend in on it, Everything and she just, like, she's like, she's like, I found this. He's like, oh, wh where'd you find it? And she tells him, and then she just puts it back exactly where she said she found it. No, I want my drone to Sac uh, sacrifice her own home. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. For more put Funko Flops on the clock. For a long-standing prank gimmick that she's never been a part of. Um, I would like my drone to play a specific song. So if Wooly's windows are open, he hears it coming. He just starts closing all the doors. And, and make windows. sure it's something that he really likes. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you create loss just aversion. Fucking plain muse. Hey, this is the other half of that letter. It is. I know your address has changed. I pray that uh, you're gonna consider stuff. Come home, man. Come home. Your mother, Augusta. Augusta. Torn from the letter we found beside the body. Why would it, this be Very here? Least, That's a good question. Yeah. That's pretty. I damning. wish I could have figured out what the fuck that ghost man was like from <laughs> catching him. Don't worry about that. And I'd have some sort of idea <laughs> of his Willie, You have to create your own you psychological were, profile of what you thought Willie, he might have been. You worry been. too much about ghosts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> This is the thing I've noticed with you. He's always worried about- Oh, me. yeah! That's the guy we definitely didn't want showing up. Just leave no, Willie, shit McCaffrey's, in the corner! No, Willie, McCaffrey's the guy you met at the bar. He said he was at home. Yeah, the, the writer. No. The writer. No, this is McCaffrey's, this is McCaffrey's apartment. apartment. You, you, the, the you Tiernan is the ghost. Yeah. Tiernan is the ghost. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> is that Got you, everything. Grover? Grover? You what are you doing in here? We're from the LAPD, ma'am. Do you know where we might find McCaffrey? I'm his neighbor. Is he in trouble? Look at that Look, bloody please, fucking pipe on the floor. And sure. Are you going to give me trouble? He has a pigeon coop up on the roof. Of course he does. He spends his mornings up there when he's been drinking. How do we get up there? Down Is the he hall a pimp? The stairs. Nah, man. He's just got pigeons, man. Drunk and in command There's of a, a pigeon coop. Pigeon. Hmm. Surely we can ride yes. him up for that. Please right. go Citation on. At least. Can be referred to as a flock of hosts. I thoughts. see. I see. What did you not infer and figure that out? No, I was just wanted to push you further. I see. I'll uh, punch him. He's obstructing justice. He's loitering. That that. Mm. Unless it's under a loitering sign, like we would do. Yeah. You know, it's. I don't understand there. loitering. Like the crime part of it. There he is. Sending his oh. pigeons to assassinate. I'm gonna fuck this bird. Nice. Norm McDonald. It's been a minute since I pushed the motherfucker off a roof. Man, Whoa. so that scene reminds me of something. I was looking up 
one of those fucking, uh, you know, one of those trash articles about bullshit the movie directors have done. Well, uh, you, you seem more cultured than I. You've seen the birds, yes? Yes. Oh, uh, actually, no, I haven't. Okay, I have. well, Matt, you've seen the birds? Yes, Great, so somebody has. You know the final scene where the birds attack the lady? Yeah. So here's the deal, here's the fun part. That lady, that actress, signed up for the birds explicitly under one condition. Right. That no live birds attack her ever. That they only use miniatures, props, etc., right? Hitchcock, who doesn't give a shit about actors and is kind of a cunt, tells the people on set, okay, she's gonna walk through the door, and I want you to take these pigeons and just throw them at her as hard as you can. And the scene that they have shot, which is like dozens of takes, is her walking through a door and guys off camera just whipping pigeons at her. And the pigeons don't like it. And she doesn't like it. And no one likes it. And there's multiple takes. Many, like a day full of takes. At the end of the day, that scene wouldn't have been nearly as good. Yeah. Cause she's afraid of birds. Guess what? She's super for real afraid on tape. Why did you yeah. even apply for a Raptors fucking movie thing. called oh, The Birds if you're yeah. scared of them? They only stopped filming Less. because her doctor was Terry like, "Listen, she is up. going to actually just fucking die." Think that <laughs> yeah. so and James don't forget that birds are disgusting and ruin dinosaurs. Real, real fear captures well on TV. I hate uh, I know birds. Caffrey didn't do the doll yet. They are uh, jerks, we have the and I don't like them. Birds are weird. Suspects. All right, back to central. If you think the list is exhaustive, Rusty, who am I to argue? <laughs> Listen, let's just work the case at hand, shall we? Then we can sit down and put all the puzzle pieces together. Yeah, but here, as but as Rusty I mean, he's, 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 li he's literally, let's arrest someone now, and then we can figure out the real crime later. That's how police work should go. Just find anybody first, I like that the time and then double check your work later. I like that the time of day changed while we were doing that. It's pretty. Yeah. It's better at night, actually. L.A. has apparently very pretty... Look at that fucking godson! That's actually yeah. a little much. L.A. apparently has very pretty weather due to the horrible, horrible pollution. So you're like, oh, look at the pink sunset. <laughs> cars. No. No, that game was terrible. No one remembers it. Oh my god, Dave Jeffy. Are you addicted to failure? Is that what's going on? God. I even forgot about that game I did play, like, like two months ago. Yeah, Drawn to Death? Yeah. Yeah. And don't forget about the new Twisted Metal, which sucked. So this last, like, everything after Since God, God of War, of War has been, like, either okay to just no one cares. Yeah, man. He's a hero. I don't- I think this is illegal. I'm pretty sure it is. But it's fucking cool. It is. There I am. This'll be a treat. Jesus Christ. Oh, you didn't have to... Just on... It's fine. Of the street there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, They're running for their there. lives and then I turned the siren on. What? Line. Why? It's Phelps, you can turn this... I think something got fucked up. Oh... Uh oh! Oh, oh big no. troubles for Wooly! Oh dear. Oh, oh no! Oh, it's fine. I tried to press the button. Okay. You sure you can make it stick with one of these suspects, gentlemen? It's either McCaffrey or Tiernan, sir. I think Jameson is an aberration. All right. I'll deal with that degraded <laughs> lunatic. Just gonna myself. go in the room and just whoop his some ass. Fearful yeah. retribution coming. Fearful <laughs> retribution. <laughs> I want the confession from one of them. Off the okay. bat, like McCaffrey, so you get excited by corpses, do you, young lad? Bloody weapons. So you should probably apartment. interview Tiernan first, and then McCaffrey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Perhaps you'll get excited by your own corpse. So you want to hit uh, interview? Yeah, if that's the way you want to do it, you want to hit interview room one and then two. Okay. I think one's right there. Yeah, one's right there. That would be Tiernan yes. in there. Okay, great. Because McCaffrey's super guilty, <laughs> super, super ultra crazy, Why fucking turbo run? guilty. Tiernan. The ghost. I was the last one to see Evelyn that night. I've seen this guy before you in the yeah. game. Yeah. Really? He looks really familiar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh shit, there's, there's a lot of shit. There's a lot of shit, and I haven't had to use it until now. So. So it's harder this way. Pawn drinks. With, uh. Yeah. Does anyone see my pawn? Okay. That was her fake name. Sure. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. 
Okay. Yep, the letter pieced together. We got both of them. Um, missing ring. Vagrant lifestyle. TOD. After midnight. Uh, Jameson was the weirdo that had the lipstick. I've done nothing wrong. Fuck you. That's what a guilty motherfucker would say. Book from McCaffrey. <laughs> There's a shit ton of evidence against McCaffrey. Yeah. With the only real evidence against Tiernan, and he was the last person seen with the victim. And she likely would be apologizing for stealing the book, is what I'm thinking. So that is still McCaffrey. And he's still a slimy, greasy fuck. And then the bloody tire iron. Sounds great. Can you describe your relationship with Evelyn? I, I barely knew Evelyn. Everyone barely knew oh her. Oh my god. I barely knew that bitch. Me and I'll have you charged and in front of a grand jury before your feet touch the ground. How can you possibly prove Evelyn and I were more than friends? That line is also used a lot. How can I prove it? I don't know. She bought liquor for you or you were seen with her? I mean, the liquor... It, we don't know if it was for him or for McCaffrey. Ah, uh, true. You know? Enter a hotel. That, yeah, well. Th this seems right. I can say I saw you with her. Yeah. McCaffrey yeah. gave you up, Tiernan. He says he saw you go into your hotel with Evelyn. I met Evelyn at the public library. We would read for a while and then go for a drink. Last night, we went back to my hotel room and had some more to drink. I must have passed out. I woke up, and she was gone. What time was this? Around midnight, maybe later. And there's no one who can confirm this? No, there isn't. I knew you wouldn't believe me. Well, it is unbelievable. <laughs> I don't believe you, also. Oh, but don't worry, because the guy who probably did it did give me that information. Yo, dude, you're fucking lucky that the other guy is way more guilty than you. you are. Belong to McCaffrey. McCaffrey saw her looking at her once and... Laughed in her face. And you're saying Evelyn stole it. She wanted something of his. Was it his dick? Dark. I believe that. I actually do believe that, Elsa. Yeah. You hate McCaffrey. You're trying well, to most people do. This. I like when Phelps guy. says shit like that, because it's like... How can you prove that? I'm like, what, Phelps, what are you even talking about? Exactly. <laughs> it's nothing personal. I just doing my job. You understand that. But you gotta, you gotta poke holes everywhere. Just poke them all over. You don't uh -oh. like McCaffrey, do you, Turner? <laughs> He's full of the common man routine, but he props up a bar like the rest of us. <laughs> Evelyn thought he was going to be a great novelist. <laughs> he had nothing but vitriol for her. That's a fancy word coming out of you, Tiernan. Yeah, not liking somebody and following them and killing them is completely different, though. Yes, very you different. We were drinking together last night, and she had no other place to stay. I don't know what happened last night. I, I don't remember. That's bad. That's a bad excuse for bad people. Oh, as I gulp. You're lying, Tiernan. Gulp. You've been fighting with her. Gulp. You fought, and I'm not lying. She got up and left. That was it. Well, then why did you weren't fighting, huh? Then how come she had to buy you a booze? She left, but she came back. She bought you a quart of whiskey to make it up to you. She told the liquor store owner, You're in deep trouble, buddy. She said she loved me. She wanted to care for me. But she would never stop talking about McCaffrey. McCaffrey was a writer, and McCaffrey was a hero. McCaffrey cared for the little guy. Did you kill her, Tiernan? I might as well have. I kicked her out. Hmm. She had nowhere to go. <laughs> but what's uh, what's McCaffrey's um, motive? motive? He's a jerk. We're yeah, gonna have, we're gonna have to talk to him to find out. Aside from that, car, we're gonna have to find. Uh, she stole his book. <laughs> Have there it is, language. there it is. That's the motive. We use a lot Something about incredibly stuff. mundane yeah. answers that yeah. just tickle you super hard. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she took my book. You know why you Whatever. did it? Because bitches, am I right? Am I right? Bitches, man. Oh. You're under arrest. Oh. What? Why? It's my favorite killer answer. Oh. My favorite. <laughs> it's so horribly perfect. And you're like, what? Oh. Really? Oh, That's it? That's the that's the big reveal. Yo, who, is, no, who killed my buddy? Is, who killed him? Is bitches, man? 
<laughs> so good. Okay. You in a car? He's dead? No, I don't. You have oh, one wrench. Man. I use a lot of them. Oh. Why, why did you kill your friend and wear a skin? Hey, friends. I want the truth. I think you broke into McCaffrey's apartment and planted a lug wrench there. Hmm. I didn't do that. And there's no way you can prove any different. <laughs> Sorry. Sometimes you have to shake the tree to see what falls out. I like how he looks away yeah. when he says that. He looks too. at the camera like, whoa, whoa. The owner's report says that Evelyn was killed with a wrench. I think you did it and then planted the evidence at McCaffrey's apartment. I just said fire. that. But we now you're saying it more convincingly. Yeah. McCaffrey was up on the roof. Evelyn stole the book. <laughs> McCaffrey went crazy when he found out. He said, he said he would put her out of her misery. He can be very cruel. Hmm. Yeah, leave interrogation. Evelyn was missing a ring from her right hand. That's strange. She always wore it. A uh, big black circular disc with a white E in the middle. It was made from an old typewriter key, a present from the prop department at her old movie studio. That's cute. Yeah, that is cool. Mm -hmm. You want to talk to McCaffrey. You need to think about what you've told us, Tiernan. You're not in the clear. So you say that you make the same accusation, but one requires evidence and the other just... Yeah, one it. is, I'm accusing you. And he's yeah. like, what? And the other is, I'm going to accuse you. I'm going to beat you up. And it's like, and he's like, oh, wow. Well, oh, I'm freaking out. No, wait, it's not this way. I don't want no I part. sure hate that. I think it is. Out? No, that's okay. the lineup. The lineup gallery? No. I want to do that. Just though. go in there and just start swinging. Harder, It'll be so fun to have that mechanic. Take out a Tommy gun. Harder. One of you is guilty. Uh, a something. And whichever is one is one? left I'm alive, I'll let go. let go. Let God sort them out. Let my Tommy God Tommy. gun sort them out. You ready to answer some questions? You think I have all the answers? You seem People like you think so. You do. This is supposed to make us feel like Rusty, Touché, which is I don't even care if this motherfucker's guilty. Let's exactly. see where this <laughs> takes us. Let's see where this takes us. Ah, lock him up. No. Oh, I hate justice. him. Justice, uh, justice, justice. You gotta do it. By, you gotta do it. No, right no, That's, man. You gotta be Phelps. Just put him away. Evelyn died sometime around midnight. Remind me, where were you? I was at home. Right. You have a manuscript that will never I'm get published. On a manuscript. Yeah. Oh, oh. You're lying, McCaffrey. You were out at the rail yard. And what do you have that proves I was there? Oh, you do have something that proves that. There was no footprints, but... The letter? Yeah, he had half the letter. How about half of Augusta Summer's last correspondence? Oh, you found gone. that, that thing that I left what in my apartment. What are you talking about? After you were done beating Evelyn... You searched her and found her mother's letter. That old lady's anguish amused you. <laughs> I know nothing about a letter or Evelyn's goddamn mother. Man, fuck you. So what was it doing on your writing desk? I don't know, but if I didn't put it there, somebody else did. I don't know. Try exercising your powers of deduction on that. No, I'm interviewing so you. So that was you correctly doing it. Mm -hmm. You got shit for that. And he just said, I'm not taking I'm your I'm accusation. I'm so this is how... We found the lug wrench that Evelyn was battered with in your apartment. And the note from her mother. And your bloodstained <laughs> clothing. We have you cold, McCaffrey. You think if I could be bothered to murder Evelyn Summers, I would be stupid enough to leave the evidence in my apartment? Yes. So I was going to say, but this is how they balance, like, having so much evidence is that you can only ask him two things you, and he the gives you nothing. Says that you killed her. You can prove that I wanted to kill Evelyn. Yeah, actually, you had a... Because of the book? You have a weird, stupid motive, but it's a motive nonetheless. Yeah, here you go. That's got to be it, right? You can use... There you go. Yeah. It's, it's satisfying when there's a tough one and you get it. Self-preservation. That's understandable. Okay, I'll level with you. Tiernan killed Evelyn. He came to me for help. Oh, now it changes. I listened yeah. to him, and he explained why he did it. Tiernan went to you for help. You expect me to buy that? That's how it went down. I told him he made a terrible mistake, but he would be throwing his life away if he went to the cops. I took his things and told him I would dispose of them. But you didn't. Speak to Tiernan. He'll give it up. 
All right. See, Seriously, now it's go back, back and, and forth. talk to him. Yeah, I see, guess. See how much you can rattle his cage. And here's the fucking thing: is if it turns I out that it was not neither of them, but the real Black Dahlia, fuck. Then what? Oh, you got a phone call I you can make. That guy from the paper. Yeah, you wanna, you probably wanna. Ooh, good point. Are you sure? Is that just not the- It's the, the phone I on the table, there. Okay. Yep. There it is, you did it. There it is. Operator, give me R and I. This shit's getting really confusing. Operator, what should I do? Phelps, one, two, four, the same seven. lady working 24-7. Every single day. Yep. She's the best. Best How in the business. I, detective? I need the jacket on a Grosvenor McCaffrey. That lady was different for some reason. Surveillance by the Red Squad. Conviction for petty theft. Dishonorable discharge from the army during training at Syracuse. Assault on a local woman. Great. He almost beat the woman to death. Ah. Uh -huh. Thanks for your help. Uh -huh. Wow. Well, remember, he said a couple of skirmishes. <laughs> okay. Can I take that back to him? Let's see. Hey, McCaffrey, what's up with you loving to kill women? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There it is! You were in the war? Yes, I was. Seeing the things that I saw. It changes a man. It changes a man. I came back here determined to change things. All I wanted was a pen and an opportunity. Oh, to Rusty speak wants to hit him so bad. before that you had only minor run ins with the police. You didn't mention petty theft. I've never been in trouble for violence. That's the salient point here, isn't it? Is it? Why would you say that when you know Lying we already McCaffrey. looked that up? You have a history of violence. We literally came in here after looking at your records. Parking tickets in a petty theft misdemeanor into an assault charge. Well, because that's what they told me that it's you did. Literally right there at the bottom, cut and fucking dry. We know like, all about you and your dishonorable discharge. Remember, McCaffrey, when you do criminal things, they write it down somewhere. <laughs> You Your fucking butts! Fraud. She was a goddamn peasant. <laughs> ah, I, I could have fought for this country. Yeah. You, you beat her because she stole from you. Because she tried to outsmart you. The ignorant audacity of the bitch! What is a man supposed to do? I was Sit in the war. Oh, me. one yeah. phone call. What is a man supposed to call himself a man? Look at Rusty get a poor deep in there. Nobody stole your book, and she got what was coming to her. That's not a great thing you just said. Let's not charge him. You should still go back and talk to the other guy to get the if, full. If you stuff. want, yeah. Can you actually do that? I yeah. believe yeah, so. Yeah, yeah, because he gave you a little bit at least. Let's come back. He'll he'll still be as guilty as he is. Oh man, I that's so fucking good. That's satisfying. You just push that one little button, he just fucking freaks out. Because that's the thing is like all the other things he was saying. Oh, behind you. All the other things he was saying was like, um, if he just doesn't list, if he just doesn't take the fact that we found evidence, right? Yeah. And he goes, I don't know how that got there. Then what else can you do? You hey, what's McCaffrey? up? I can go. It's all been cleared up. Not quite. <laughs> question we need to ask. This is Jane. awesome. This is awesome. Then I think we yeah, just be. play them off sure. each other. Go ahead. Events prior to murder. So Evelyn passed out, and you walked out. What happened next? I woke up in the morning. Yeah. Very hungover. I thought Evelyn would have come back. <sighs> you look believable. I know you're lying. You have James. five intuitions, by the way, Wally, if you want yeah, to. Yeah, you got one. tons. Tell me what really happened. I don't know what you're talking about. How, how can you say I wasn't in that His hotel? head is going nuts right now. He's shaking yeah. like crazy. How can you say I wasn't in that hotel room? <sighs> I believe that would be even McCaffrey's accusation. accusation. Yeah. You wound up at McCaffrey's. You were still incredibly drunk. You passed out on his floor. It's time to tell me what really happened. McCaffrey woke me up the next morning. And he showed me the lug wrench and the letter and the box. And he said I came in with him last night. He said that I killed Evelyn. And that it was all over the radio. And that he would protect me. And I don't know, Detective, for the life of me, I can't remember a goddamn thing. I was angry with her. Really angry. I could have done it.
It wasn't me. That's rough. So that's how they actually make you doubt, because he was drunk, so he doesn't remember. So now you got to decide. The, now the core of it is, is he lying about that particular event? Because oh, he, he could have just gone out and killed her, and then McCaffrey's just drunk on his floor. Or sorry, Tyrion's drunk on his floor. He's like... I could just tell him I he fucking did it. That, yeah, was, exactly. that was so worth getting back up. Oh, yeah. Hey, McCaffrey, so what's up? It. But, I mean, you want to put this guy away, so... But oh, did he there's act no... No, 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 hold on, stop. In my head, the fact that he's got a history of almost doing this is fucking open and shut. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah for sure. But and then he and the fact the that the, the instant you say, hey, she stole your book, he's like, oh, no, I'm so glad she's dead. And he's, he frames the guy because he has a perfect motive and he has the ability to hide it. It's not a perfect motive, but he has the ability to hide it with a guy that has no memory. Yeah. And he's emotionally unstable, so he can just put it in his head. Been right, but there's still, like, this guy's still, way smarter than means there's still a percentage that the guy, the other guy could have done it means just in a drunken thing. Tiernan's not smart enough, uh, you know? Means opportunity. No, no he's not smart. Smart. Motive, right? That's your three elements of the crime. He has so much means and opportunity here. McSlime slime job absolutely mo uh, like lo manipulated Tiernan. Oh yeah, and maybe. Fuck it. I'm charging you with the murder of Evelyn. Summers. I want. I want she the was a sad lady. I've never hurt anyone except herself. I hope God finds a way to forgive you. Oh, the disgust. So strange. How about that Congratulations, reaction? Congratulations, boys. You bagged the fine catch. Thank you, Another Cap. Another red to boot. Grant. Now, I want you to put this business about a repeat offender Now, you just ignore all that shit. This McCaffrey creature shows no remorse. And neither will the grand jury. To be honest... You would have to walk a long mile to find a better candidate... Exactly. ...than Mark Plot at a prison Exactly. Radio. And if you undo that with a, a bullshit thing afterwards, it's gonna take away from it. It's, oh man, it's gonna take away from it if you watch undo it, it. Say, guess what, Wooly? That was wrong. It's gonna say it right in the game. Oh, okay, ready? <laughs> Unless they were all members of the same cult. Yeah. It, sometimes it puts doubt at least. Hey, you found say. every single goddamn clue. Grats. E. There ah. you go. It doesn't. That seemed pretty, pretty case Rough. closed. And stuff. Fuck you, McCaffrey. You're a piece of shit. Damn red. I love that. You get the one phone call. She deserved it! Oh, man, that's... Because oh. you really can't do much if they keep saying, I don't know. I don't know who got that there. Who put that there? That medic is the crazy, the bravest man alive. Now we rally with the first. They're trying for the Naboos. It's here to the left. To the right, it goes right through a pass with two Naboos and Inflate. Mate, we can lose everyone. The lieutenant. Get back off this fucking bridge. They'll start walking the mortars back to their own. Positions. We only have I'm minutes. in charge here, Sergeant. Get your men off the bridge, Lieutenant. What's your unit, Sergeant? We don't have time for this, Lieutenant. What's your unit, Sergeant? I company 22nd Marines, Lieutenant. And we just saved your ass by boarding the river. My orders are to reconnoiter the... I think that point is now Jesus moved. Christ. You have ten men left. My orders are to save what's left. Move out! And calls like, yeah, I guess. Phelps is by the book, even when bullets are whizzing. It's yeah, like, he's, it's he's, most important that you salute me. The quarter of the universe. <laughs> he's the Cyclops of this, of this oh, universe. Oh, absolutely. Like, was that a, an orc doing an or like a, a bomb sacrifice? Yeah, I think it was.